Okay, so we are at NLIT today. Um, we are uh, presenting our project to the public. Okay, the project is Renergetic, and I'm going to show you the VR communication tool that we have developed for the project. Okay, so the setup is in a in something like an island okay a very green place okay with lots of vegetation okay and here we have our energetic temple okay in which we can set up a, an energy island so the main idea is that we have several areas displayed in this place Okay, and the idea is that you can set up your energy community or your energy island and you will go answering the questions regarding the, the characteristics of your energy community. Okay, so right now we only have three working areas, four working areas, sorry. Okay, and each of them has a questionnaire. Okay, and once you answer all the questions of the questionnaire, it will show you the epics that you can apply to your energy island okay the idea behind the epics is how you can benefit from your current setup and how you can make the most of it involving uh, your citizens and the and the tools that Brunergetic has to offer okay so we're going to start with the commercial area in this regard, it's asking us if the Renegetic Island has office buildings. We're going to say yes. Okay, it's going to ask us uh, if uh, can the average office buildings can be considered a standard. When we're talking about a standard here is that if it's a normal building that has no PV, no nothing, no, no generation, no energy ge generation, that is a standard building. But if it's not a standard building, which is I'm going to answer now, no. Then it's going to ask us if we have rooftop, if we have uh, other, other characteristics, okay? So we can say that, yes, we have rooftop. Yes, we have a heat pump. And yes, we have battery storage. Okay, also if we have a EV well box. Okay, and then it's gonna ask us, um, is the average office buildings provided by a heating distribution system? We can say yes or no, no being a zero, and then the percentage, okay? In this case, we're gonna say that it's about 50%. Okay, also it's asking us by an electric distribution system, say we have a 50%. And is the average office buildings a small, medium, or big? Okay, we say it's medium. Number of office buildings, we say it's gonna be five done okay then it's also asking us when is the energy peak according to our region okay we're gonna say summer does the energetic uh, does the island have administrative buildings we're gonna say yes can the average administrative can be a standard um, a standard can be considered a standard we're gonna say yes so we don't have to say all the renovation characteristics okay small okay we have eight both okay and now here we have all the consumption that we have in our in our commercial area and then we're when we are done we can choose the epics and it's going to show us which epics apply to each area okay in this case, when we see that we have social campaigning that we can apply on all the areas because they are all marked in green. Okay. We can also apply EV demand response. Okay, it's telling us it's in this area. And if we have more epics, which is something that we are working on right now, we can we can place them all on here. Okay. And then we have the to be function okay so the to be function copies all the information that we have taken from the assist situation okay all the all the configuration that we have already that we are starting from and then we can simulate what happens if 
we made several changes on our energy island, okay? So in this case, wanna, we're going to change what we have answered in this regard. And we're gonna say that, uh, well, we are okay with all these questions, but now we're gonna say that we have other options. <laughs> I am recording a video of the use of the, of the tool. Yeah, 